Hi, heathens. So I have my, I'm pretty sure January uh, 2024 Slay Glam Box. They were a little behind. I've been a little behind. It's fine. We're here. So I love this packaging, by the way. It's not the normal um, mailer. So cute. It's giving me like spring vibes though. But without further ado, we're going to get on into it. And <laughs> if I can, um, I did see spoilers, but the only thing that I remember is what the palette was supposed to be. So it's going to be a surprise. What is this? Ooh, okay. There's a five piece, five piece Mana Kadar beauty brush set. That's cool. Put that down there. I won't open that right now because I do have quite a bit of brushes. All right. So we have a lot happening in here. So let's, let's get on into it because it looks like there's two palette type things. All right. Oh, I see what's happening. Okay. This is January and February. So this is January <laughs> and this is February. So let's do January first and then we'll move into February and then we'll see what we're going to try out. That makes sense. Okay. <laughs> I was really confused why there were so many palettes. All right. So the January palette, which is the one that I did know, is the Four Seasons Pressed Pigment, Pressed Pigment Palette by Rasha B Cosmetics and SS. I'm honestly not 100% sure if, if someone knows kind of who that collab is, let me know. I'm sure it says somewhere on their socials as well. This is so pretty. It's kind of a variety, which makes sense because it is the four different seasons. So it's a variety of color stories. So in my brain, we have spring, summer, autumn, winter. Um, and as always, we have some gorgeous looking shimmers. So you've got uh, the whole top row is mattes. The whole bottom row is also mattes. Oh, I just realized that the bottom shades are named for the seasons. So I was correct. And I'm also just kind of silly. This shade winter is a matte, but it has a bit of the like shimmery tone. Whereas all of the other bottom ones are just straight mattes. So I just looked at some of the names. Those are cute. Okay. <clears throat> so let's put this back in its outer packaging. We have a lipstick here, which I'm not going to open because I do know that the shade is not going to work for me. It is the Amoros Matte Lipstick. And I have this in the shade Always Nude which it is, but it's like that shade of nude, which is not going to flatter me in any type of way. So that will find another home. Then we have Amuse Vivid Lips Lip Liner in Ginger. Which looks like it's going to be a brownish if the cap and base are anything to go off of. We have... Ooh, okay, this is exciting. I do have a little bit of blush on today. I was doing some door dashing anyway. Um, so I have a little bit of makeup on, but this is from Beauty Creations. It is the Barely Blushing Oh Sweet Cheeks uh, liquid blush. So you have Passion Pink and Coral Flush. So that's gonna be exciting. And then last but not least for January, we have by Amoris Clear and Clear Eyeshadow Primer. It is a matte finish. And hold on, I want to open it because it looks like there's, yeah, I'm a little confused because there's like a, a thing in the middle. And also on the, 
on the back. Does anyone see something wrong here other than me? Sir, and clear. What? How? Are they two different things? I don't know. I'm gonna have to look into that and see why there's like two sides because it doesn't seem based on packaging that they would be anything different from each other. So a little confused. Okay, now, February. <laughs> Find out what we've got in here. And then that will determine what we are going to use. So the first thing in here is a Manzi Meow. I'm saying that wrong, I'm sure. Laboratories of Nature Wine Lip Tint. And it is in the shade Chardonnay Orange. That actually I'm going to try because it sounds interesting and I have not used a lip tint in quite a while. I don't know how well this lipstick is going to come off because it's pretty long wearing. So let's try to, can you hear Casper trying to get in? Goodness. Hopefully I'm using an actual makeup wipe and uh, not something else. Okay. Let's open this. Oh, okay. So it doesn't open like fully from the top. Oh, that smells really sweet. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna find something with a mirror. Hold. Actually, I'm gonna open this palette because there are two palettes in February. Uh, so let's go ahead and finish and then I'll put that on. So these are two lip liners also from Amuse. The perfect lip liner in pearl pink and in cola. And then we have two palettes, both from Be Bella Cosmetics. And I'm very excited to have gotten these two because there was actually a third palette option which I have received before, not from them, but just in general. So I'm excited to have two palettes that I have never tried. So first we have Lotus Love. Ooh, I don't know why I was expecting it to be more so we have one shade that's kind of cracked, which is Spring Lotus here. But very nice, like pinky, purpley, springy uh, shades. And it does still fit with Valentine's, but yeah, you can see that little, kind of, oh, can you see that? No, it does not want to focus, but there's a little crack in that shade. I want to swatch sunlight real quick because it looks like it might be a glitter. Okay, it is. Oh, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, I'm really confused because I wonder if the other ones do. So it swatches like it's going to be a normal glitter because you can even kind of see the chunks. But then... They all just like blend out really well. <laughs> they, I have like nothing on my fingers even. Okay. That was kind of surprising. All right. And then we have the Be Bella Shades of Roses, which of course I'm assuming is going to be a slightly more red themed palette. Ooh, okay. I really like this one. There is some pinks and purples still, but gorgeous. And I'm going to swatch some of these too. So Mia Moore is definitely like a chunkier, glittery type um, shade. Yeah. 
Okay, so that one is kind of, why do I do this? Kind of what I was expecting the others to be like. You can even tell. Um, and I still have some on my finger. But then we have Beauty, which is one of those like mattes with shimmers in it. And Rosa, which is like a gorgeous, gorgeous, like white silver. Okay. That brown swatched kind of weird because of how I went over my hand. But look at that white. Good Lord. Okay. So I'm going to use this, <clears throat> this lip tint real quick. That spot on my lip is going to be really dark compared to the rest because I have, like, no skin. So it's going to soak into that a lot more. I like that color. So we're going to let that sit for a bit and then like do the little pat. And all I'm going to do, because I do have existing eyeshadow on, is I'm going to take Rosette, which is like a red and silver kind of shimmer. And I'm going to put it over top of what I have on and see how it kind of yeah, because see, you can see those, like, glitter bits from that shade. There's not a whole lot of, like, face color. But those glitters are gorgeous. I hope you can see them uh, on camera, the way they look in person. Maybe you can on my finger. But, let me. <clears throat> I'm going to have glitter on my finger all night now. I like that. All right, Whew. a lot of makeup in today's video. Very excited to try them because these are all going to wind up being in other videos except for that one lipstick that I just, I know isn't going to work for me personally. Um, so let's take, okay, I think that's the color we're going to be left with. It's kind of, there we go. <laughs> my lips were kind of like not hard but they needed moisture it's a really nice shade of like red orange okay all right so that is my January and February 2024 slay glam bags boxes together if I'd known that I would have split this but we're here now so let me know your thoughts down below. Uh, thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you're most excited to see me try. And if you have any insight into this little guy, please let me know what's going on with that because I am going to look into it as well. And uh, that's it. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs> Maybe.